Welcome to the Hunter Report. Why do I have two computers here? Well, we're testing out Adobe Lightroom. I have this MacBook Air 11 inch from about two to three years ago. And Lightroom was being very slow. I'm a photographer. You might know me as a comedian or as a techie, but I'm also a photographer. And Lightroom was being really slow. It was, I was shooting hundreds of photos and it was taking a long time to cycle through each photo. So I say to myself, well, um, this, actually, this MacBook, this old MacBook Air that I have actually has an incompatible graphics card with Adobe Lightroom. So I go, oh, well, why don't I just get a Mac that has a compatible graphics card? So I did. This is the latest MacBook Pro. This has four times the amount of RAM as this. I have four gigs of RAM on here. I have 16 gigs of RAM on here. The processor here is like twice as fast as the processor here. Um, and it has a compatible graphics card. So you'd be able to tell very quickly um, if the reason that Lightroom is slow is because of a graphics card compatibility issue or what. So I have the same photo set here. This is about 500 megabytes of raw files. To ensure that there's no caching going on, I have just re-imported the photos to the Adobe Lightroom catalog. So there's no possibility of caching. We're both at two to one magnification and let's hit the right button. Loading, look at how slow that is. And look at that, the MacBook Air took less. You got all the information you needed right there. The MacBook Pro was actually slower than a three-year-old MacBook Air with four times less RAM, 16 gigs RAM here. Lightroom runs slower. Um, so that just shows you that this is not a hardware-bound performance issue. The issue is the software is written poorly. Now, when you say the word Adobe, what is the next word that pops in your mind? That's right, Photoshop. Adobe is, yes, a massive company that has billions of dollars spread out in areas that have nothing to do with photos. But um, every, but every photographer has actually complained about the slowness of Lightroom and I hope that this demonstration here that has cost me a lot of money to get this computer that I clearly do not need as much as I love Apple products um, but uh, they didn't actually let me test this in the store at Apple so that's why I had to go and buy this uh, and I was assured that I can return it um, when, when the demonstration proved the point that I knew all along. Um, so let's just do a few more photos to show you how difficult Adobe makes my work. Look at that, five seconds per each photo. If I'm shooting thousands of photos, literally thousands of photos in a day, and I have to wait just even three seconds, four seconds, that was about four and a half, five seconds in between each photo, um, that makes my life hell. So um, the problem is with Adobe Lightroom. Guys, you really need to up your game. My name's Hunter Paris. This is the Hunter Reports. Please subscribe and please give me thumbs up and let's get Adobe on the ball here.